Today's military makeover is brought to you by the Navy Mutual Aid Association. You know, no one seems to want to take care of the veterans except for the veterans. The, the people in America seem to think that the government takes care of us. That couldn't be further from the truth. I have problems, man. I'd be right here at a heartbeat. I want the veteran to, to, to really come to the reality. This isn't a handout. This is a hand up. I was in for five years. I did uh, three tours in Iraq. And to see those statistics of 20 veterans a day, you know, taking their own lives, it's Suicide. heartbreaking. That's my motivation every day I get out of bed, and that's why I want to continue my education and get the tools that I need in order to help my, you know, brothers and sisters in arms. Just hoping, you know, I can help one veteran maybe get that number down one. Ed served three tours in Iraq, and he was one tough devil dog. He saw and experienced more than his share of pain and suffering. The loss of comrades in arms, it affects them all so deeply. They all carry invisible wounds, wounds that can have disastrous results when they return home. We're here to recognize his service and the service of all our military and veterans, all those who run toward danger for us. Ed got love and guidance from his late father when he needed it. His dad's advice, go get help. They are there for you, and so are we. Receiving counseling at the VA allowed Ed to move forward and heal. And then, he literally became re-inspired. You know, we, I started going to the VA, and uh, they, uh, you know, it, it was good to talk to someone, to, to let them know what was going on. They've, they've helped me, they probably saved my life. A light bulb went off in my head. I was like, this is what I wanna do. I want to help other veterans. I want to show them that there's, they're not alone and that there's things that can help you and you're, you're not by yourself. Recognizing the sacrifices of our veterans is what Military Makeover is all about. And we're shifting into high gear. Art! I gave you this list at the beginning of the show. Uh -huh. uh, how far have you got? Well, we're really storming the beaches in there. We're leading from the rear. You know, uh, we're, really, we're really killing it. In other words, you've ignored the list, huh? Well, here, I'll, I'll look at your list here. How about a five-letter word for overbearing, pompous, uh, shouting? Get out of here. What's that? At ease. Oh, that again? what I got to put up with. Art, get out of here. All right, gunman. Gunman. Oh. First order of business, kitchen demolition with construction manager Ryan Stanley. So I'm really excited and I'm about ready to start tearing this kitchen out and I love doing kitchens. What we're gonna do is they like to entertain so I wanted to increase their area for a countertop space and entertain area. And Ryan is a one-man wrecking crew, taking out all the kitchen cabinets on his own. We've also brought back his good friend from our Kansas City makeover contractor, Chris Dirks. Yeah, we're gonna pull that down, pull that one down. Ryan and Chris are a terrific team. If these guys are anything, they're flexible. The tip for you at home on any home project, be ready to adapt and overcome. And we're adapting with new technology. Partner Tough Built is setting up Chris and Ryan with high-tech contractor tool belts, tool bags, cool saw horses, and a whole lot more. Tough Built is a product that was made by contractors for contractors. We think about innovation. It all starts with this technology. It's patented. It allows Chris to be able to clip on his tool belts where he wants them, when he wants them. The Clip Tech belt and pouch system. Our guys can literally have a pouch to fit every job. Carry only what they need, when they need it. And industry first in adjustable, interchangeable pouches. And Chris is putting together Tough Built's universal quick set miter saw stand. We got a donation of 1,200 square feet of LVT flooring from the Home Depot. Tough Built Gel Fit knee pads are going to make a couple of days worth of flooring installation a lot more comfortable. A great donation from Razorback Professional Grade Tools put shovels in Ryan and Chris's hands. So thanks, guys. Razorback Tools are also taming the backyard jungle in the hands of our incredible group of Home Depot volunteers. The Home Depot is never afraid to get their hands dirty and lend their time and their effort to a project such as this. And we do it around the country continuously. 
Here specifically, we really got dirty and we really got sweaty. There are 35,000 Home Depot associates that are veterans. So it's a big piece of who we are and why we love to give back. The Home Depot volunteers are tearing out a ton of old fencing and landscaping. Volunteers of all ages. Sand abilities, all enthusiastic. Well, for the Tool Runner Group, it's, it's a big opportunity for us to show the team here what tools we have. The Home Depot is proud to be here, to be a part of the military makeover. All that hard work outside, and finally our inside superstar has arrived, Jennifer Bertrand, interior designer extraordinaire. But did anyone tell her about South Florida summer heat? I come bearing gifts. Thank you. Florida is so hot. Well, enjoy it. Another Kansas City native who is determined to make a huge difference in Ed and Mandy's home. Tell me what's going on in here, because this is going to be Mandy's arts and crafts room, right? Right. But so I'm bringing in a special person, my mom. Oh wow! To help me. I know, right? She's a sculptor and she's an amazing artist. So we're going to do a feature wall, and we're going to make it look like branches and flowers and birds. You know. I think it's going to be good. And listen, if your mom's anything like you, I know it's going to turn out amazing. My whole family's lovely. We're now in high gear, both inside and out. Hey, Gunny, uh, what you got going on over here? I thought you were involved in some high level strategic planning operation. I am. Yeah? Why don't you go on over there on the other side of the house and help those boys on there? Uh, yeah, I've, I've been helping. Is your insurance paid up? Are you prepared for an emergency? Or... Yeah, why do you ask? Well, because I'm going to come rain some pretty serious stuff down on you if you don't get over there and help those boys on the other side of the house. Move. Move! In the backyard, Team Depot did an amazing job cleaning the jungle. Tony English and team are really executing Ryan's big cleanup plan. Volunteer painters from Rebuilding Together of the Palm Beaches are virtually everywhere following Jennifer's orders. Rebath is well on the way to finishing their natural stone showpiece. To everyone's dismay, we're going to be without AC for three days. Uh, don't tell anybody. We need some air in here. I know. We'll give you a fan. It's my mom's. As long as you give it back to her. And how about a power backup system from Eaton? You do know it's hurricane season, right? Jay, how you doing? Hey, Art. Good to see you. Glad to have Eaton on board. Listen, this is an amazing piece of machinery. I want to hear all about it. But first, what drew you to being a part of this military makeover and helping out Ed and his family? Well, I'm really excited to be part of this. Uh, I'm an Air Force vet. I was in the Air Force for eight years. And when all else fails, it's always good to have a backup generator. Right. Uh, power grid, especially in South Florida, can be uh, unpredictable at times. And this is a great peace of mind to have. So tell me, how does this work? It's, it's always ready to go, and there you hear the thunderstorms are rolling in. So we need to get this installed pretty quick, <laughs> right? How does it work? So this is a 22 kilowatt natural gas fired backup powered generator. When you lose utility power, this will automatically come on and pick up all the loads in your house. That is fantastic. And it's basically a, a set it and forget it kind of system. Exactly. So there's, there's logic in the controller uh, that, that runs a weekly diagnostic cycle and make sure the generator is always ready to go uh, if you lose power. The generator runs on natural gas, so that's being managed also. The all-important automatic transfer switch is the brain, choosing utility or backup generator when needed. So this is the ATS. This is the automatic transfer switch. So tell me exactly what this system does. So we have power coming in from the utility through the meter and into the top of the switch and then the generator comes into the bottom of the switch. If the utility goes away, the switch switches over to the generator, generator picks up the loads. So they never have to worry about being out of power. But there's another feature here that's important. Right, uh, the, this is a green ATS, and you see the circuit board inside here uh, allows you to shed loads if the generator started to get bogged down. Um, so for instance, your air conditioning hooks up straight into that circuit board, and that circuit board decides if the generator is starting to bog down, it can turn your air conditioning off and keep the rest of your loads on. Right? So the lights stay on, the appliances stay on. They All your critical the loads AC stay on. For a little while, right? right? That's an excellent, excellent thing to have. We got this, okay. Jim. Okay. okay, so we're gonna take this. We're gonna go outside, get started, okay. and I'm not gonna let you fail. Cool. Thanks. Jim Schneider is with our sponsor, NBKC Bank of Kansas City. Using skills he doesn't know he has, he's going to create an original piece of art for Ed and Mandy's master bedroom. It's our Kansas City body. Made for Florida. Oh, yeah. My body 
He's like, what's going on? We're melting. Yes, okay, so um, here's the thing. I like to make something out of nothing, okay. and she loves texture and wood. Okay. So I'm going to draw on this, and all you have to do is color inside the line. Oh, it's easy. like elementary school. I can do that. So Jen gave me this kind of an artsy project, and I'm not artsy whatsoever, so she helped me out. She gave me some little cheats, uh, drew some designs, and kind of I filled in uh, the blanks or colored in the lines. But it's a nice project with a palette and a meaningful saying that, that hopefully will speak to Ed and, uh, Ed and his wife, Mandy. Life is only as good as your mindset. Ooh, that's good. Do we like that yeah, one? Yeah, I like that. I do like that. You do? Yeah. Okay, done. Veterans hold a very special place with NBKC Bank. Years and years ago, we made it our mission to help out veterans individually and their families. What I'll do is I'm going to do a quick, like, gestural drawing of okay. it. Life is only as good as your mindset, right? Correct. Okay. And then you're going to go through and make the lines a little thicker. Okay. You got this. Thanks. NBKC Bank is just proud and thrilled to be able to help Ed and his wife Mandy individually on this house, but also the thousands of veterans that we work with nationwide. I highly encourage everyone to volunteer. It is legitimately good for your soul. It feels so good to work and sweat with these people. While Jim is sweating it out becoming an artist, we asked our vet Ed Tag to meet with veterans benefits specialists from the Navy Mutual Aid Association. Hey. We've asked them to shine a light on the transition from military service back to civilian life. I know I had challenges when I transitioned out of the military. How about you? Challenges, uh, I don't even know a big enough word for that. When you get out, they try to educate you the best they can while getting out of the military, but you know the separation briefings and things like that didn't cover. So when you were in that one week transition course, it, you, you heard maybe just a small percentage of it? I don't even remember five minutes of it now. No. We've heard that from others. I mean, it, boot camp is maybe eight or ten weeks to teach us how to become a Marine, sailor, soldier, airman, whatever. But then when we get out, we have like one week and they just throw everything at you. As a Marine, you learn to take, take care of yourself and your, and, yeah. your, and your unit, but you don't, you don't ask for something that you don't think you need or, or even rate. Mm -hmm. And it's and there you, you don't want to feel like you're taking advantage of somebody. You earned it. It's, yeah. it's you earned benefit. it. Yeah. It's an earned benefit. My uh, wife, she, uh, I know she's new to the the lingo and the terminology, mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. not just with the military side, but now with the benefits side as well. She she's yeah. been now she's a, mm -hmm. classified as a dependent for me, and it's just. You know, she's learned about all of these different things. It's a new vocabulary, yeah. and she needs to learn it, and she needs to know where your important papers are, and at some point um, need to help put that narrative together, because when the time goes, something does happen to you, you do pass, and she's entitled to benefits. She needs to provide the documentation, whether it's your DD-214 and other things, so that a veteran's benefits specialist can help make the narrative and connect the dots and say service-connected disability, service-connected compensation, but you have to put that together by knowing the story. So at some point when you talk about that or you lock it up in the file cabinet and as long as she knows where it is to get it together, somebody else can piece it together for her. That's one of the things we do at Navy Mutual is provide financial education. Um, it's free of charge to veterans, retirees, and their families. So I will tell you that you just got married. Um, you're still a newlywed. You got a beautiful house. Yes. All right. Uh, you might want to think about doing a deeds assessment <laughs> and, and taking a look at what's really what you need. And um, I really appreciate it. It's been an honor and a privilege to to converse with you today. And and just for Marine Rain, Semper Fi. Semper Fi. Thank All you. Right. Thank hey, you so much. Enjoy. Ryan and Russ are working with Monty Smart Security to give the tags smart control over critical parts of their home for safety and to help them save money on utilities. Bruce. Art, how's it going? How are you? Doing Great good. to have Monty on board. Glad Listen, man, uh, we appreciate your help. Security systems, super important for any family, Absolutely. but especially for Ed and his family. Tell Absolutely. me why. Couldn't be happy part of this. Security in today's world is really more than just security. It's home automation. You can see my guy Steven here, who's also a veteran. Hey, uh, thanks it, for your service, man. He's still on the cameras, so 
So we're doing a lot of great things with cameras and door locks and thermostats and light modules and motion sensors. So it's really more than just security and really helping to protect all families and more importantly help protect our veterans in a sense to be safer in what they're doing today. Come home, have automation, be able to push one button, house lights up, thermostat cools down, cameras are active. Well, we, we can't thank you enough, but there's a lot going on there like you mentioned. Absolutely. So listen, if Gunny starts yelling at you guys that you're not working hard enough, tell him I already talked to you. All right, all right. thanks. Appreciate doing a great it. job. So what do you get when you partner one of the largest financial institutions in the world and one of the best charitable organizations in the United States? Well, you get what we have going on here today. Veterans helping veterans. Jerry from Wells Fargo, Bob from Scholarship America. So great to have you on Military Makeover. I want to start with you, Jerry. Tell us about Wells Fargo's commitment to veterans. Today, we employ 8,600 veterans that love to pitch in on jobs like this and, and help improve homes and so on. We're watching Ed and, and all of his progress and the way he helps veterans. And that's exactly what he does in his career. And to further that goal, he's been accepted to FSU. And you guys have come up with a plan. Wells Fargo had a dream and Scholarship America. Bob, you guys help administer that dream. Tell yep. us about what you do. Our mission is to uh, help students uh, pursue their higher education dreams and goals. And you've done that since your founding. Exactly, exactly, for almost 60 years. Uh, in that 60 year period, we've helped uh, about 2.3 million students and have uh, dispersed about $3.7 billion. Well, you're doing great work, both of you. And yeah. if we haven't given too much away, folks, have you guessed it yet, what's going on here? You'll have to wait to find out exactly what we've put together for Ed uh, at the final reveal. Great work, guys. Thanks for being partners with us here at Military Makeover. Looks like we're almost done. Yeah. Said no one ever on this thing. Is it air on? No. It just shows the importance of air conditioning. Chris Morgan and his team from Premier Comfort have teamed up with Goodman brand HVAC to have a dramatic impact on the comfort situation in this home. What we like to call Operation Comfort. We had all hands on deck to get this place feeling cool and comfortable. The temperature inside yesterday was about the same as it was outside. And now we've got our friend Chris from Premier Comfort Services installed a brand new Goodman HVAC system. What was the toughest part of doing an install in an older home like this? The toughest part of doing an install in an older home is most of them are in the attic. And yesterday in the attic was 124 degrees. Wow, wait a minute. 124 degrees. 124 degrees, yes. So we didn't lose any people on this job, did we? No, we didn't. <laughs> so what, what did we do? You, what was the first step of the process? Well, the first step of the process, we do what's called a heat load calculation. So then you pick out the correct system, and what did we end up going with? Well, with a 16-seer, three-and-a-half-ton Goodman. So not only did we upgrade the actual AC system to cool more efficiently, we got more efficient with this amazing digital thermostat, completely Wi-Fi controlled. One of my favorite features about the thermostat is once they start driving home, the thermostat can tell they're on the way home and comes on automatically. It's a scorcher. You know what's worse than heat? Well, Chris, and as we leave the comfort of that beautiful air conditioned oh. room in there, we step out into the heat as well over 90 humid here in West Palm. I'll a new uh, energy uh, efficient, area. refreshingly affordable Goodman air conditioning. When well, your whole room feels like it's the hottest place on earth, it's good to know there's a local Goodman dealer nearby. The main advantage is it makes it less dirty. Dirt is the number one enemy of your air conditioning system. Yes, you don't want any of this sandy blowing in there. Speaking of airflow, how about some cool airflow, man? Yeah. Let's get back Let's inside. Let's get back inside. Great job. <laughs> Episode two of the Tag Family Makeover campaign is coming to a close, Art. Yes, sir. Ryan, Jennifer, and Chris are getting it done. Are you keeping up with them? Not only am I keeping up, I'm leading them. I'm like an officer here. <laughs> an officer. Art, you wouldn't make a halfway decent private or PFC. Matter of fact, if you were an officer, you would be giving me orders and that wouldn't work. Exactly. Listen, a guy can dream, right? That's exactly <laughs> what it is, a dream. <laughs> Listen, on the next episode of Military Makeover, we're bringing our vet and his young bride back to their beautifully remodeled home. So join us for the big reveal. This is the Gunny and Art saying, Semper Fi. Hoorah!